You know what's missing from most holiday music? Math problems. Thankfully, we've got just the present you didn't know you needed. I'm not talking about my book, How to Solve Word Problems, although that really is the perfect present. I'm talking about this classic Christmas carol, which dates all the way back to 1780, The Twelve Days of Christmas. It's about 12 days of presents, which adds up to a lot of presents. Just how many? Let's see. A. How many presents does The Twelve Days of Christmas add up to? B. Can you find a fast way to get to the answer? On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree. So that's one, one present. On the second day of Christmas, my true love gave to me two turtle doves and a partridge in a pear tree. You see, not only do you get today's present, you get the presents from the previous days as well, repeated. That's a pretty good deal. Lots of presents. Now, let's think about this. On this day, we received three presents. Two turtle doves plus one partridge in a pear tree is three presents. But how many presents is that total, counting day one and day two? One plus two plus one equals four. We're up to four presents total. On the third day of Christmas, my true love gave to me three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. On the third day of Christmas, we received three plus two plus one equals six presents. But how about all the days put together? One plus two plus one plus three plus two plus one equals 10. 10 presents, and we're only on day three. On the fourth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me four calling birds, I don't know what that is, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. That's one plus two plus one plus three plus two plus one plus four plus three plus two plus one equals 20 total on day four. On the fifth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me five golden rings, I guess one for each finger, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Total presents? One plus two plus one plus three plus two plus one plus four plus three plus two plus one plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one equals 35. Do you see what's happening here? It's speeding up. On the sixth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me six geese a lay in, that's a lot of eggs, five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Total presents? One plus two plus one plus three plus two plus one plus four plus three plus two plus one plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one plus six plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one equals 56. On the seventh day of Christmas, my true love gave to me seven swans a swimmin, so you're gonna need a pool, six geese a layin, five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Total presents? One plus two plus one plus three plus two plus one plus four plus three plus two plus one plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one plus six plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one plus seven plus six plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one equals 84. Do you have any guesses how big this is going to be? More than a hundred? On the eighth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me eight maids a milkin, I don't know if this includes the cows, seven swans a swimmin, six geese a layin, five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Total presents? One plus two plus one plus three plus two plus one plus four plus three plus two plus one plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 
7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 8 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 equals 120. So yes, definitely more than 100. On the ninth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me nine ladies dancing. That's a lot. Eight maids a milkin, seven swans a swimmin, six geese a layin, five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Total presents: one plus two plus one plus three plus two plus one plus four plus three plus two plus one plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one plus six plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 8 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 9 plus 8 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 equals 165. I think it might be over 200. On the 10th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me 10 lords a leapin. We're going to need a bigger house. Nine ladies dancing, eight maids a milkin, seven swans a swimmin, six geese a layin, five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Total presents: one plus two plus one plus three plus two plus one plus four plus three plus two plus one plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one plus six plus five plus four plus three plus two plus one plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 8 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 9 plus 8 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 10 plus 9 plus 8 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 equals 220. Is it over 300? What do you think? I think so but I don't really know. On the 11th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me 11 pipers piping. Oh, that's not annoying at all. 10 lords a leapin, nine ladies dancing, eight maids a milkin, seven swans a swimming, six geese a layin, five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. Total presents. 1 plus 2 plus 1 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 8 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 9 plus 8 plus 7 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 plus 10 plus 9, plus 8, plus 7, plus 6, plus 5, plus 4, plus 3, plus 2, plus 1, plus 11, plus 10, plus 9, plus 8, plus 7, plus 6, plus 5, plus 4, plus 3, plus 2, plus 1, equals 286. While I'm here, let me remind you, I have a book for sale, How to Solve Word Problems. It's really great. Okay. On the 12th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me 12 drummers drumming. That's got to be incredibly loud. 11 pipers piping. 10 lords a leapin. 9 ladies dancing. 8 maids a milkin. 7 swans a swimmin. 6 geese a layin. 5 golden rings. 4 calling birds. 3 french hens. 2 turtle doves. And a partridge in a pear tree. Total presents equals 364. So here's our answer to part A. How many presents is that? 364 presents. That's almost one present a day for a whole year. And if you think about it, you could take off your birthday because you're going to get a present that day anyway. So yeah, one whole year's worth of presents. Now for part B. Is there a faster way to get this answer? There is. You can figure out this puzzle more quickly if you know about triangular numbers and tetrahedral numbers. The number of presents from day one is one. There's nothing triangular about that, but look at day two. The number of presents from day two is three. We can use them to make a triangle like this. 
the number of presents from day three is six. By adding a row onto the bottom, you can make a bigger triangle. The number of presents from day four is 10. Add another row to the bottom, and so on. We say the nth triangular number is the total you get in a triangle with n rows. If you add up the triangular numbers, you can get a set of tetrahedral numbers. Now we move from two dimensions into three by stacking up, like a triangular pyramid, which is also called a tetrahedron. First, you have just one ball on its own. There's nothing special here. But when you get to the second day, we get one plus three equals four. And if they're stacked in three dimensions, with three balls on the bottom and one balanced on top, it forms a tetrahedron. Let's move on to the next day. One plus three plus six equals 10, and you can stack another layer of six balls on the bottom to form a bigger tetrahedron. You can keep going, adding more layers on the bottom, forming bigger and bigger tetrahedrons. That's what we do to visualize how many presents there are over the course of the 12 days of Christmas. The triangular numbers tell you how many presents you'll get on that day. The tetrahedral numbers tell you how many presents you'll get total, adding all the days together. There is a formula you can use to get there even faster. The tetrahedral number for n equals n times n plus 1 times n plus 2 divided by 6. So the tetrahedral number 1 equals 1. The tetrahedral number 2 equals 4. Tetrahedral number 3 equals 10, and so on. Now, we'll save the derivation of this formula for another video. Actually, it'll probably find a home on our Axioms channel, where you'll find all sorts of these kinds of math puzzles that mathematicians love. So stay tuned for that. Maybe tell your math teacher to subscribe. You should subscribe too. You never know, math has a way of sneaking up on you and giving you lots of presents. Speaking of presents, don't forget to buy a copy of How to Solve Word Problems. It's the perfect present. Find the link below.